With her performance in the television show Dark Angel, actress Jessica Alba became a household name. In the Fantastic Four movies, she also portrayed Sue Storm. Stay tuned, because we will dive deep into her life, career, workout, and diet routine in today's episode. And if you're looking to get the celeb workout inspired workout equipment mentioned in this video, I'll link it in the description below. Let me know if you have a favorite celebrity you'd like me to feature in the comment section below. Thank you for tuning in if you're new to the channel. Now, let's get to the video. Jessica Alba's Life Jessica Alba is a person of many different backgrounds who was born on April 28, 1981, in Pomona, California. Her mother is of Danish and French ancestry, while her father is an American Mexican. She spent her childhood moving about a lot because her father was a U.S. Air Force member residing in California, Mississippi, and Texas before relocating to California. By the time she was 12, Alba had an agent and had started studying acting in her early teens. She landed her first movie role in the 1994 comedy Camp Nowhere. Additionally, she obtained a modeling job and worked on a few commercials. Around this time, Alba was cast in a recurring part in the well-known tween comedy The Secret World of Alex Mack, which is about a girl who acquires superhuman abilities. She also ventured into the water with an Australian-produced, brief replica of the popular aquatic adventure series Flipper. After several cameo roles, Alba was granted the starring position in the science fiction series Dark Angel. James Cameron, who also directed the program, conceived of it. It debuted that autumn. She portrayed Max Guevara, a genetically altered young woman who had fled from a genetics research experiment that employed kids as test subjects. The show's plotline focused on her hunt for other members of the project as well as the government's attempts to apprehend her. It was set in a post-apocalyptic Seattle in 2019 and told stories about both. Logan Kale, portrayed by Michael Weatherly, was a journalist that she collaborated with. Alba and Weatherly established a personal connection off-screen and briefly got engaged. Despite receiving some positive reviews, the television series Dark Angel only had two seasons. Honey, in which Alba plays a hip-hop dancer and choreographer, surely made Alba's big screen debut. It wasn't a critical success, but teen audiences liked it. In Sin City, she then took on the role of a different kind of dancer, a stripper with academic prowess. By this time, Alba's Fantastic Four introduced a fictional superheroine to the world. She portrayed Sue Storm, one of the four astronauts who acquired strange abilities as a result of being exposed to cosmic rays. In the 2007 sequel, Four, Rise of the Silver Surfer, she reprised her role. With Scott Kane and Paul Walker, Alba took on yet another daring role as a diver who gets into trouble after finding a sunken jet in the movie Into the Blue. As Dane Cook's partner in the romantic comedy Good Luck Chuck, Alba gave it a shot. Both attempts received negative reviews and failed to draw a sizable crowd. In the Eye, an adaptation of a Japanese horror movie, Alba continued to take risks. She performed the role of a musician who experiences some negative side effects after having an eye transplant. Alba was cast in the Mike Myers comedy The Love Guru, resuming her career in comedy. The actress stayed active, even though many of her appearances were in ensemble casts or lesser-known movies. She kept working with Sin City co-director Robert Rodriguez, making appearances in his movies Machete, Spy Kids 4, All the Time in the World, and Sin City, A Dang to Kill For. Additionally, Alba made an appearance in the light-hearted miniseries The Spoils of Babylon, which debuted on IFC at the beginning of 2014. Alba went on to appear in the action comedy Barely Lethal, The Eerie, The Veil, and The Suspenseful Mechanic Resurrection, but only the last generated any significant box office interest. When LA's Finest, a spinoff of the Bad Boys movies aired in 2019, she finally made her long-awaited comeback to television as a co-star alongside Gabrielle Union. Alba married her lover Cash Warren, whom she met while working on The Fantastic Four, in May 2008. Honor Marie, a daughter was born to Alba in Los Angeles on June 7, 2008. After Haven Garner, who was born on August 13, 2011, the couple welcomed Hayes Alba, their first boy, on December 31, 2017. Tell me you're excited about back to school without telling me you're excited about back to school. I'll go first. Oh, I can't believe you're going into eighth grade. Why aren't you a baby anymore? Here, wait, sanitize for all the filthy germs and mask. You never know. Wait, wait, your teacher. Oh my God, mom. What? Make it happen. I love 
Mom, it's still summer. As much as I'd like to continue talking about her life and career, we are here for her workout routine as well, aren't we? Let's see what's the secret behind her amazing figure, what is her mindset, and how does she keep in such good form with her workout routine? Stay tuned as we continue with her workout mindset in today's video. Jessica Alba's Workout Mindset Jessica enjoys staying active. She doesn't really like working out, but loves the feeling after a good workout. She makes an effort to work out four times per week and considers it a triumph if she can. She accepts the fact that some weeks she can only work out a couple of times. I'm gonna be straight with you guys. I don't like working out, but I feel really good after. It gives me energy. It just sets a good foundation for the day. Being healthy and strong helps me feel confident and beautiful. <laughs> She enjoys going on walks with her friends and loved ones, and she keeps very busy throughout the week with her kids. When she can, Jessica enjoys exercising with her friends and attending group sessions. Working out alongside others in her opinion is more enjoyable and inspiring, but even if she is alone, she doesn't mind. She even worked out while she was pregnant. This is true dedication. Three sets of this. Back on the machine. Oi. And he's the one hurting me. Jessica enjoys varying the cardio exercises she does. She will engage in varying amounts of HIIT and steady state cardio. Her exercise routine occasionally entails taking a long walk or hike, but most of the time she goes to the gym. She might invite a friend to go with her if she can. She began taking solo walks more frequently while listening to podcasts throughout the pandemic. Jessica will use the treadmill for both running and walking. She usually uses the machine on an inclination to walk and run to prevent too much impact on her ailing knees. She will typically use the treadmill for some time, about 30 minutes. She switches it up by running both long distances and short sprints. Sprints might make the time go by more quickly for Jessica because she dislikes jogging. She enjoys taking dance and spin classes to get on some extra cardio. Jessica likes participating in hot yoga lessons. She prefers it when there are some light weights in the sessions so she can do some resistance training in her classes as well. She attributes the way her body looks to yoga. She particularly enjoys the style of yoga known as power flow yoga. Every pose in this style of yoga seamlessly transitions from one movement to the next. It is a vigorous and quick yoga program. It may be harder to master than other varieties because of this. It necessitates stamina, strength, and stability. Resistance bands are another exercise tool that Jessica likes to use. Resistance bands can be a great substitute for weights if you want to increase the difficulty of an activity, but don't want to use them. She abides by the following rules, which are excellent advice. Make your training routine work for you. Jessica has discovered not to be overly accommodating with her workout durations. As her schedule permits, she now rotates between morning and evening workouts. Workout variety. 
Jessica switches up her workouts frequently to keep her body on its toes and keep herself interested and motivated. She occasionally trains according to the standard rep counts, and other times, she trains to the clock. Always warm up before working out. Rather than doing the monotonous typical steady state warm ups, she pulls from dance and yoga warm ups like the sun salutation. Alba always has her favorite music playing in the background while working out because she enjoys moving to the beat. Follow your instinct. Jessica doesn't force herself to follow a regimen of exercise. She will instead go on a trek if she doesn't feel like lifting weights. The importance of post-workout recuperation is something Alba is well aware of. She ensures that she sleeps for seven to eight hours every night while massaging her muscles with a foam roller. In addition, she consumes a nutritious protein and carbohydrate supper 90 minutes after finishing her workout. My fitness routine is very inconsistent. Um, I wish it could be more consistent. I always feel great after a nice, good sweat. Um, I like loud music, I like hip hop music, and I like friends. And so anything that I can do with all of those things combined is my favorite. Um, but I, I don't always have time to work out. I've learned to let go my idea of perfection. I've learned to be okay with not completing things sometimes. Um, and I've learned to sacrifice working out at night to have a nice healthy glass of wine. <laughs> the maintenance of a good body requires more than just working out. When attempting to maintain your fitness, diet and eating habits are quite important. Jessica prefers to eat a healthy balanced diet and doesn't restrict herself to too many sweets but she also steers clear of foods high in sugar and carbohydrates. She has low blood sugar and low blood pressure, and her body functions best when she consumes lots of salt rather than sugar. To refill her body, she can drink coconut water or water with salt after working out. Additionally, she makes an effort to limit the amount of soy, dairy, gluten, fried, and processed foods she consumes. Before we continue with her workout routine and diet regimen, I would like to mention that if you're looking to get the Celeb Workout Inspired Workout Equipment mentioned in this video, I'll link it to the description below. Stay tuned as we continue into the next section of today's video, Jessica Alba's workout routine, to get a better sense of her training routine. Jessica Alba's workout routine. Strength, circuits, yoga, cardio, and core exercises are all included in Jessica Alba's workout. For many years, she has collaborated with Ramona Braganza, a personal trainer. Whenever she is making a movie, her trainer frequently comes along. Her regular alternation between cardio and strength training is the key to her incredible physique. With this in mind, let's find out what exactly Jessica Alba does for her workout routine. Monday, upper body. Jog two minutes. Run six minutes. Jog two minutes. Dumbbell bench press 20 reps. Dumbbell inclined bench press 20 reps. Dumbbell flies 20 reps. Medium grade sprint for 30 seconds, then jog for 30 seconds. Dumbbell bench press 20 reps. Dumbbell inclined bench press 20 reps. Tricep kickbacks 20 reps. High grade. Jog for 2 minutes, run for 6 minutes, then jump rope for 2 minutes. V ups 20 reps. Bicycle crunches 20 reps. Twisting plank 20 reps. Tuesday lower body. Jog 2 minutes. Step ups 6 minutes. Jog 2 minutes. Forward lunge with dumbbell bicep curl 20 reps. Squat thrust 20 reps. Squat press 20 reps. Sprint 30 seconds, then jog for 30 seconds. Walking lunge with dumbbell bicep curl 20 reps. Squat thrust 20 reps. Squat press 20 reps. Ab crunches 20 reps. Bosu ball knee tucks 20 reps. Four arm planks 3 sets of 30 seconds. Wednesday back. Stair climbing, two minutes slow, then six minutes fast, and two minutes slow again. Dumbbell rows, two sets of 20 reps. Bent over dumbbell flies, two sets of 20 reps. Dumbbell lateral raises, two sets of 20 reps. Stair climbing, two minutes slow, then six minutes fast, and two minutes slow again. V ups, 20 reps. Bicycle crunches, 20 reps. Twisting plank, 20 reps. Thursday upper body. Dumbbell bench press, two sets of 20 reps. Dumbbell inclined bench press, two sets of 20 reps. Dumbbell flies, 20 reps. Tricep kickbacks, 20 reps. Ab crunches, 20 reps. Bosu ball knee tucks, 20 reps. Forearm planks, three sets of 30 seconds. Friday, lower body. Forward lunge with dumbbell bicep curl, 20 reps. 
Squat thrust, two sets of 20 reps. Squat press, two sets of 20 reps. Walking lunge with dumbbell bicep curl, 20 reps. V-ups, 20 reps. Bicycle crunches, 20 reps. Twisting plank, 20 reps. Saturday and Sunday, rest. She lets her body get the much needed rest after the intense week of working out. You can follow her workout or adjust it to your liking. Whatever you decide, make sure you do it safely. Once you start being active daily, especially if you weren't before that, you will realize that even the easiest workout routine is not that easy if you're not used to it. Now that we learned about her workout routine, it's time to find out about her diet regimen. Jessica Alba's Diet Kelly Lavique is a nutritionist and wellness consultant who specializes in holistic nutrition and she advises Jessica on her food choices. The Fab Four Diet was developed by Kelly and it places a strong emphasis on including protein, fat, fiber, and greens in every meal. Even though she doesn't always do so, Jessica generally does. This diet's intention to assist with blood sugar regulation is one reason Jessica enjoys it. Jessica is grateful for the freedom she has with this diet because there is no calorie counting involved. Finding a method to maintain Jessica's blood sugar and appetite levels throughout the day was one of the things Kelly and Jessica worked on together. Kelly advised Jessica to make sure she always eats breakfast, which may be challenging to accomplish when you're a busy mom. In addition, she advised Jessica to avoid consuming carbohydrates at every meal and snack, and instead concentrate on eating one dish of non-vegetarian carbohydrates each day. With that said, let's find out what's her diet regimen for a typical day. Breakfast, smoothie, coffee. Lunch, chicken stir fry with zucchini noodles or meatballs, parmesan cheese and broccoli, or a salad. Dinner, a salad, or chicken quesadillas with corn tortillas and hot sauce. Whether you try her workout and diet regimen or not, remember that you must find what works best for you and allow your body to relax to avoid overworking yourself. Before we wrap up today's video, I would like to mention that if you're looking to get the celeb workout inspired workout equipment mentioned in this video, I'll link it to the description below. As always, I welcome your suggestions for who I should feature next. Thank you for watching this episode. Please make sure you like and subscribe to this video and channel since that will help us make more content like this for you to enjoy.